Blue Jays hosting the Rangers, and the Rangers are plus 122 on the money line. The Blue Jays are minus 144. The over-under is nine runs. The Rangers getting a run and a half on the run line are minus 166, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. And the Blue Jays laying a run and a half on the run line are plus 139, meaning if you bet them that way, they must win this game by a minimum of two. Now, thank you for everyone who has joined the Discord and whose book consultations. I really appreciate you guys. If you have not done so yet, go to my website, rossportstalk.com. You'll find merch like this shirt and you'll see the membership tab. Uh, the 1499 one gets you my best picks. And it'll also give you a link to the stat sheet. The baseball stat sheet, I've been doing my best to update, but it's hard with all of these games. Football is updated. Um, just food for thought. It's a separate link. There are two separate links there. Dunning pitched once against the Blue Jays this year. Six innings, two runs, two earned. They won that game 4-2, to two, and he struck out three batters. They are 1-4 and four as a team in his last five starts. He's averaging five innings pitched and uh, 6.4 strikeouts per game in those games and he's got an era of 2.8 they've lost his last four starts and the over has hit in his last two games although the under is three and two in his last five he's pitched three times against the blue jays once this year twice last year all with the rangers all three of those games went under and in those games he averages five and a third innings pitched six hits 2.7 earned runs, four strikeouts, 1.7 walks, one home run, and 86.7 pitches. So he's given up a home run in every one of those games. For the Blue Jays, Bassett pitched once against the Rangers this year. Three and two thirds, five runs, three earned. They lost that game 11 to seven in Texas, and he struck out two batters in that game. They are three and two as a team in his last five. He's got an ERA of 2.2, averaging six and two thirds innings pitched and 5.4 strikeouts per game in those games. He has pitched against the Rangers three times in the past, once this year with the Blue Jays, and then twice with the A's in 2021. In the games overall, the under is hit uh, twice. He's two and one in those games. Uh, they, he averaged five and two thirds innings pitched, 5.3 hits, 1.7 earned runs, 4.3 strikeouts, 1.3 walks, and 87 pitches. Head to head, the home team's on a two game winning streak. The home team is six and four. The Blue Jays are six and four. The Rangers are on a two game winning streak against the Blue Jays. The favorite's on a three game winning streak. The favorite is eight and two on the money line. The favorite or the underdog getting or laying runs are five and five. There have been three one run games in their last 10 meetings. One in the last series they played against each other. The over-under is 5-5, five and five, and the over-under at 9, 5-5. Five five. They played each other three times this year in Texas. The Blue Jays took the first one 2-1, to one, and the Rangers took the next two 4-2 to two, and 11-7. to seven. The Rangers have been horrible lately, but they are on a two-game winning streak. They're 3-7 and seven in their last 10, 2-2 two two in their last four, and the over is 8-2 and two in their last 10, but they were playing the A's in the last series, but, you know, that's always a team that, you know, kickstarts a lot of teams winning streaks and for the blue jays it's quite the opposite they're on uh they are eight and two in their last 10 they're on a three game winning streak as well but they're they played the royals so both of these teams are coming off of uh, really bad teams i'm gonna take a shot here with the blue uh with the rangers as a road underdog i'm gonna take the blue jays uh the rangers with the money line i don't know why i keep saying blue jays rangers with the money line rangers getting the runs and i'm gonna go under in this game these are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.